Okay, so today I have another experiment to show you. Um, as you can see, um, this is a RC lawnmower. So I uh, didn't have a chance to record the step that I I put them together, um, but I can explain uh, some of it here for you. Um, so this is my old 15 years Murray Walmart uh, lawnmower, and uh, the engine still run very good. It's just that. Uh, Recently, I uh, realized that the whole front wheel is uh, no longer working because it was a self-propelled and uh, the whole shaft, front wheel shaft is wear out to the, the, the bearing, wear out to the metal. So very much it's no good. So I'm thinking about, well, I'm gonna have to come up with another 300, 400 for another lawnmower. So I was thinking, you know, and you know, I also, because I see, you know, some of this on the, on internet already. So I'm thinking I, I might just invest the money into something more exciting. And here, what I came up with, uh, I got the motor, the wheel, from eBay, I guess from the wheelchair um, on eBay. And uh, I got this set of wheel on Amazon. Um, so um, just to kind of go through the price, the cost, I mean, I got these motor, two of them for 60 bucks and I got the two wheel around 60 bucks again this thing right here actually cost me almost because of the um, tax and the shipping and all of that is so heavy $65 and it become almost like what $80, $90 just for that two set of wheel right there and then this box right here is my, uh, it's one of those old, old uh, uh, hair clipper box that uh, I throw it around. So I think it's pretty good for my project. So I took it and then I install this little voltage here so then I can see how much voltage I have. And then inside here is my uh, remote, I mean, uh, is a receiver and the speed controller, dual motor speed controller. Uh, very, there are a few uh, different models out there, but I picked this one because it looked very nice and it looked very clean, simple. So one thing I want before I open this, one thing I want to kind of a, this is the first, uh, I think I did this way. I don't think anyone else on the internet do this. So most of people will come up with an SLA battery or a LiPo, but this is what I use. So here is my speed controller duo and uh, the receiver. Here is my 3D print DeWalt adapter. So I will show you how it works, how it's plugged in. I mean, I would have my 5 m I mean 5 m battery, I'm sorry. Um, it would last me almost the whole of my yard, but I do two of them just to see, you know, in case you run somewhere longer, bigger, yeah, or whatever, blowing around, running around, wasting the battery. 
And then uh, there's a different way people mount it into the lawnmower. Um, but I mount it this way. Uh, my motor is up, up top. Some people mount that the the uh, motor is lower down. And then uh, I came up with the you know wire so then you can unplug if you want to. There you go. You can just unplug in there. Unplug it if you need to. Uh, and then. Uh, this one right here, this bar right here, I just put it in lately because these two right here seem to be strong, but are actually kind of weak. After driving around, hitting a lot of places, it get bent and sealed with it. It's already messed up. Um, it bent, so I have to. Um, make strengthen it a little bit with this so then keep that two together okay so let me show you how the whole thing work with the battery on it all right so here is my dewalt battery <laughs> you might laugh at it this is a fake dewalt battery I bought it on Amazon. Someone say it's good, someone say no good. So I try it out. Very cheap, like what, $60 for two of these thingies. It says 6M. But I would say um, it works. It's just that the juice is not very good. The juice is not really there. I mean, it. Uh, very fast to uh, to uh, to uh, run out, and it's, it's just not keeping the M the voltage up pretty good. But it it kind of okay to use for some light task. So here I slide in here like that, like that. Okay. And then close it up. And then here is my control. This one I just bought it on Amazon for another what fifty five bucks or so. Um, okay, so let's power on. And I make a little power switch right here. And there you go, 20 volt, my fake DeWalt battery. Yeah. So here, look at this. So I this lawnmower I took everything out. I mean I the only thing um so like right here is the uh, throttle cable. I mean it stay there without a cable so that that's good. Now this one over here this thing is what it's supposed to be uh killing the you know growl, turn off the engine and uh, safety or whatever so i just make it like this so then i just uh when i need to stop i just do like that and it ground it and it stop and if not I, I didn't want to ground it on this thing right here with down this one it keep it keep clicking rattling so bad because it got a little teeth the tooth or something in there like a i don't know what it is it's just making rattle noise when it when it go in there so i have to stop it running in there so just like that and i will run it for you to see how it like 
So, so I'm gonna give it some what? Okay. Until it run out of gas. Oh, it's empty. But anyway. If you have any question, uh, how do I put them together or anything, uh, let me know. Uh, thank you. <laughs>